So in this tutorial, I'm going to tell you how to make this plain, boring, white sky into something a little bit better. First of all, what we'll do is in this picture, which I'll leave in the description, just click more info and to subscribe if you want to follow along. What we're going to do is zoom in a little bit. We'll grab the lasso tool, or rather, the polygonal lasso tool. And then, we're just going to go along the horizon and the rocks and everything. Start off here. You want to do it little bit by bit, don't do it fast, because it could register as you finish with your selection and then you'll have to start off all again. And if you get to a point where you'll need to move across the image, just hold down space on the keyboard and that'll give us the ability to move around a little bit. And to zoom in and out, I'm just using my zoom slider on my keyboard, but what you can do is press control and minus or plus on the keyboard. So when you've finally done that part, to finish it off you can just click anywhere, join up where you first started, and that's that. What we'll do now is go to our sky layer, which I'll also include in the description. Next you'll need to press Ctrl and A on the keyboard to select it all. Then Ctrl and C to copy. Go back here. And then what you need to do is just go back here. Go to edit paste into and you can see that our sky has been pasted and so what you'll need to do from here is just zoom in and you can see that some of the sky is kind of rough and fake to blend it in what we'll need to do is just press control and click on our sky layer to get the marching out and then go to select go to modify and feather from here what you can do is enter the amount of pixels you'll want it to feather I'm just going to do it to two it may depend, you know, vary depending on your image we'll deselect it after that what you can do is just click on this cursor here and you can move the picture around the way you want it which you think fits the picture best and works in a more realistic way. As you can see the, the sky here next to the sea is kind of dark so all we need to do is get the rectangular marquee tool and then we're going to start off about halfway just above the island and drag it all the way down. From here we need to go to select, modify, feather and this time we're going to do a rather large one. It's going to be around 250. So then we click OK. From there we can go to adjustments and then levels we'll just move this a little bit there and that a little bit there you can see that we've edited it in a more realistic way if we zoom in we 
what we'll need to do here now is just grab the sponge tool so we can desaturate the C to blend it more in with the picture So as you can see, this is somewhat a whole lot more interesting. And obviously some things were rushing this tutorial, but if you take more time, some things can look better. Just use the basic concepts, and you're good to go. Until next time, thank you for watching, goodbye.